Taiwan's president made an historic visit to California on her way home following a trip to New York and Latin America. Taiwanese officials who visit the U.S. can further deteriorate their nation's relationship with China. As Skylar Henry tells us, the implications of the visit are wide-ranging. House Speaker Kevin McCarthy welcomed Taiwan's president Tsai Ing-wen to the Reagan Presidential Library in California Wednesday. It's the highest level meeting on U.S. soil for a Taiwanese leader in decades. The friendship between the people of Taiwan and America is a matter of profound importance to the free world. Tsai is hoping to shore up support for her democratic nation as the threat of a takeover from China grows larger. And she was met with a bipartisan group of lawmakers promising to stand beside her country. The urgency of keeping the beacon of freedom shining cannot be understated. Congress has stepped up its criticism of the Chinese Communist Party in recent months, though the Biden administration, like many before it, still wants to avoid major conflicts. Our objective remains the same, to have peace, to have stability. Beijing opposed the meeting and just hours earlier launched a military patrol operation in the Taiwan Strait. Last August, China's military conducted live fire exercises after former Speaker Nancy Pelosi visited Tsai in Taiwan, just 100 miles from China's coast. How high tensions are. Isaac Stone Fish runs a China-focused risk and research company. He says these congressional meetings send a clear message. It shows to Beijing that parts of the U.S. administration are willing to defend Taiwan in the case of a Chinese invasion. Official U.S. policy recognizes Taiwan as a part of China, but President Biden has said he would provide military support to Taiwan if China invaded. Skyler Henry, CBS News, Washington. Taiwan produces the vast majority of advanced computer chips used in everything from smartphones, automobiles to medical equipment. The ripple effect of a potential military conflict could shut down production, limiting supply and skyrocketing prices of everyday consumer products.